But yeah, I honestly do not even know where to start. It's giving me like aura vibes, you know what I'm saying? This is the next option. This is kind of which was exactly what I wanted. Hi everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel. So it is currently 6.39 and today is Sunday, August 22nd. And I'm talking to you guys right now because I start school tomorrow. I am so excited <laughs> and I actually have some things that I need to get done tonight of course to kind of prepare for tomorrow and just for the entire school year in general and I thought it would be kind of a fun video to take you guys along with me to prepare for back to school. So I have done a couple of things over the past couple of days. Um, first I got my nails done which was so exciting because I haven't gotten them done like professionally in a very long time. I just got these super cute almond shaped pink French tips. I love them and then yesterday I did clean my room because I know for me personally a clean space equals a clean mind which I definitely need for the school year and then last night I did also go to Target to pick up some things so first I just got two of these half inch binders they're super tiny which was exactly what I wanted basically I'm taking two core classes this year which would be English and psychology and then I'm literally taking like three art classes now last year I just used two folders to organize all my papers which was fine although I definitely got unorganized at some points so I just think these will be a little bit better and they really do not take up that much space at all then next I got two notebooks I know last year I used up like three whole notebooks but then again I was also online for the majority of the school year and so I was taking a lot of like handwritten notes and stuff like that in notebooks I just ended up getting this plain pink one and then this really cute polka dotted one next I had to get a planner I am obsessed with this one this is like exactly what I was looking for although I did kind of think I wanted like a smaller one just because I I had one of those last year and I really liked it and they did have a smaller one of this although it was so tiny like there was no way I would have been able to like write anything down it's giving me like aura vibes you know what I'm saying and it definitely matches like my wall so that's kind of like the theme and like vibe that I'm kind of feeling right now so that's all that I got for school supplies I am gonna put you guys on real quick though because I had to stock up on some of my favorite lotion this is the EOS shea butter 24 hour moisture body lotion first of all this smells absolutely amazing and it leaves my skin feeling literally so soft. It definitely smells like Vanilla Bean Noel or whatever it's called from Bath and Body Works during Christmas time. But yeah, so that's all that I got from Target last night. And now as of today, I worked 11 to 3. I came home. Um, I had some dinner just a little bit ago. And then after I ate dinner, I filmed a video actually. I've been meaning it to film my back to school clothing haul for a very long time. I've just been so busy. So I kind of had to push off until today, which was fine because I actually think that I'm I'm gonna like how it came out or at least I'm really hoping because I've been having one of those days where it's like I just don't like anything that I film and like I just do retake after retake after retake and it's just been so annoying but I was able to get it finished so that's good now over the past couple of days I've been feeling extremely stressed just about school coming up and making sure that I get everything done that I need to so the other night I did go on my notes app and I made just a list of things that I need to get done um, that would just keep me more organized and definitely feel a lot more prepared for everything and it definitely is so nice just to be able to like look at everything and just see like this is what I need to do plus I love that on the notes app it has like the checkbox feature so you can check things off so let's see I did clean and organize my room I filmed my clothing haul and I got my target run for supplies I got my nails done then as well and then that's all that I've done so far on my list the next thing that I actually want to do is pick out my first day outfit anytime Time I pick out like an outfit I like to do it before I shower just because I don't like trying things on and like changing and stuff when my hair is wet and like all of that kind of stuff I would just much rather do it before so I have a little pile of clothes over here those are the things that I just put in my back to school clothing haul so I'm probably going to be wearing something from that pile but again I also have like my whole closet full of stuff I've done a lot of shopping this summer so I'm sure I won't have a problem finding something to wear so I'm definitely gonna walk you guys like through the process of me picking out this outfit and everything and then I'll probably show you guys like the options and the ones that I'm choosing between but I'm not going to show you guys what I end up deciding on because tomorrow morning I'm going to be filming like a get ready with me and I will show you guys my outfit then so stay tuned for all these videos because I think this is the one that I'm going to be uploading first but yeah I honestly do not even know where to start I got four pairs of really cute jeans for back to school and I love all of them so like I would be totally fine wearing any of them as for some of the shirts 
boots that I just got. Um, I did just wear this one to take Instagram pictures, so I low key don't want to wear it on the first day. It's that bad. I did get this really cute top from Brandy, so I might want to wear that. I kind of feel like I should wear like a short sleeve because I don't want to have to worry about bringing a jacket. But at the same time, like it doesn't really matter. I don't know. Because I did get this really cute tank. I feel like this would be really cute with an outfit. Okay, I'm just going to put everything up on my bed. And then I am going to go through my closet and see what I have in there that I might want to wear. Okay, so I kind of have some outfits laid out on the floor right now. This is what we got going on. I think I'm gonna just hop right into it and just try some of them on. I feel like that's all I can really do at this point. Okay, so this is option number one. This is really cute. I don't think it's the one though. The thing with this is that I would have to wear this jacket all day and I really don't think I wanna do that. So this would be another option too, like the crop jacket instead of the longer one. Okay, this one I can get behind. It's definitely a lot more simple, but I think it's still really cute. I don't think this stomach showing would be a huge issue, so. But I definitely think I would feel a lot more comfortable in this during the school day rather than having to wear like a jacket because I wanted to wear a tank top. I also just love the way that this shirt fits so this is definitely an option. This is the next option. This is kind of like the same style shirt from Brandy Melville. I really like this one. I think it makes my figure look really good so I could wear it with these jeans or I have another pair of polyester jeans that I'm about to put on that I got that I think would also look cute with this. These are the other jeans. I really like these too but I'm kind of leaning towards the first ones. Can we just take a moment for this set? Oh my god. Okay, so I've had this shirt from Garage for a while and then I saw that they came out with these pants recently and I was like, oh my god, I need those. But yeah, I took my shower and everything. I'm about to let this mask sit for I think 15 minutes. I actually don't remember what this mask is called. Beauty Sleep. It's the Lush Beauty Sleep mask. So good. Looks super cute on, which I feel like is an important aspect when looking to buy a face mask. And it literally makes my skin feel so soft and it's just... I love it. It also smells absolutely amazing. I just took off my face mask and then I also washed my face with my Neutrogena cleanser that I use. And then I just put on some of my Glow Recipe Watermelon Glow Pore Tightening Toner. Next, I would normally go in with my The Ordinary Hyaluronic Acid Serum, but I'm all out and I have not had the chance to go to Ulta. So I'm just skipping that for now and putting on some of my moisturizer. This is the Garnier Skin Active Moisture Rescue Refreshing Gel Cream. That is a mouthful. And then I'm just gonna put on some of my Huda Beauty silk balm. I am going to brush my teeth and stuff of course but I do that right before I go to bed because I have to put my Invisalign in which I do not wear nearly as much as I should but at least I wear it a little bit rather than not at all. Okay now I'm about to take care of my hair and then the stuff is my favorite it's the Ava NYC 10 in 1 Made Magic Primer. I just sprayed some of that in my hair. It does a whole bunch of stuff but I mainly bought it because it helps detangle which I have had a huge problem with especially ever since I dyed my hair hair. Now it's not nearly as bad today because I used a hair mask while I was in the shower. I just realized I left my music playing in the background. I am so sorry if you can hear that. Let me pause it. <laughs> By the way, I've been listening to my safe space playlist on Spotify the entire night. It is my favorite playlist ever. It's just like the perfect thing to listen to, to do literally anything. I'll listen to it when I'm driving, whenever I'm doing homework, whenever I'm cleaning, whenever I'm doing like a self-care night, literally any time of the day doing any activity. But anyways, like I was saying, my hair is not nearly as bad as it normally would be today because I had used a hair mask while I was in the shower. My favorite one is the Herbal Essences. I'm not exactly sure of the whole name of it, but it's by Herbal Essences. I'll put it up on the screen. It literally makes my hair so soft and it smells so good. Okay, but anyways, um, I'm gonna finish up using my The Ordinary Cold Pressed Virgin Marula Oil. I'll just put a couple drops of this. 
in my hands and then run it through the ends of my hair. All right, now that every single inch of my body is clean and moisturized, I am all done with my self-care and skincare portion of the night. So I'm going to go back on to my little to-do list that I made on my notes. All right, so I did shower and all of that. I picked up my first day outfit, can't forget about that. I did my hair care, I did my normal skincare routine, did a face mask, and I washed and exfoliated my face. So now I just have to do kind of the last little section that I wrote on here. I need to write down my schedule in order and my room numbers because it just helps things like become so much clearer. And then I need to lay out everything for the morning. So I'll lay out like all the products that I want to use, um, my lotion, deodorant, perfume, um, hair products, all that kind of stuff. And then I need to put together my backpack. I'm about to organize my backpack and this is the backpack I'm using. It's one of the basic North Face backpacks. I've had this for a while. I don't remember what school year I used it. It was either my freshman or sophomore year. And I have not touched it since. Um, first thing I see is a water bottle. We're gonna throw that out. I don't even know what's in here. What is this? Oh, this was definitely my sophomore year because this is all AP seminar stuff. Oh, this is my old planner. This is so cute. Notebook that I needed for a class that we literally wrote in twice. More papers. I don't like reaching in here. It's like really scary. One of these little strawberry candies. What the heck? Alright guys, I packed my backpack, I laid out all my things for tomorrow morning, and I think I am finally done preparing everything for tomorrow and just the entire school year in general. Definitely be sure to subscribe if you're not already and come back and visit my channel over the next like week or two because I have a lot more back to school videos coming out. But thank you all so much for watching, I really hope that you enjoyed, this was pretty fun to make. And now I'll be vlogging tomorrow morning again for a little get ready with me. Make sure to follow me on Instagram. Instagram and all of that good stuff. My socials are always in the description. I post on Instagram quite frequently, so that is definitely the place to keep up to date with me. But again, I really hope that you guys enjoyed and that this was fun to watch, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys.